Welcome to the Battle of Lechon. We're on the left. We have the double deep fried in oil pork belly. And on the right, we have the air fried healthy lechon. Let's see who will win. How's the taste? Hey guys, it's me, Kuya Milton, and today we are making one of my favorite Filipino recipes. Lechon Kawali, wow. or in English, crispy pork belly. If you haven't tried this, this is 10 times better than bacon. Mm. And special thanks to Josefa, Elena, and Miss Skywatcher for suggesting this video. And not just anybody's lechon koala recipe, it's Panglasan Pinoy. I actually know Panglasan Pinoy. I have followed him on YouTube before. He's one of my favorite chefs. Sabi ko dati sa sarili ko, hindi mo na makikipag-collaborate formally sa iba. Hanggang hindi ko nakakasama itong aking mentor. Ito na yun. Napapayag ko na rin siya. Kamusta na rin guys? Part of Panglasan Pinoy's recipe to make super, super crispy is that we have to deep fry it in all of this vegetable oil. But for some of us, deep frying our food all the time is not healthy. So, to compare Panglasan Pinoy's recipe, instead of deep frying in all of this oil, we will be using... Air fryer. I don't know which one is gonna taste better, but let's find out. So this half will follow Panglasan Pinoy's deep fried in oil recipe. And this half, we will use the air fryer. First step is to season our boiling water. Five to six bay leaves, one and a half tablespoon pepper. Next, pork belly. Once it starts to boil, cover. After 15 minutes, flip so that it cooks evenly and put back the cover. After 30 minutes, take it out and let rest. After we let it cool down and we can handle it, add the salt. All right, time for Panglasan Pinoy's deep fry. Add skin first and don't forget your cover if it's squish. Oh. <laughs> oh. Cooking is the leading cause of home fires and home fire injuries in the U.S. Oh my gosh, I thought it was going to explode. Okay, Panglasan Pinoy says to flip when we stop hearing loud sounds from frying. Oh wow, look at that. You see that? Wow, looks good. Okay, it's been about five minutes on each side. Now, we're gonna take it out of the oil and let it rest. Wow, golden. So, it smells so good, I wanna eat it right now. But, Panglasan Pinoy says let it rest and then we're gonna add it back to the oil to make it super, super crispy. Okay, we've waited about 10 minutes. Now we're going to add the pork belly again to refry. This time skin side down to make it extra, extra crispy. Oh! Alright, let's take it out. Look at that. Wow. That's nice. Oh my gosh, look at that. Wow. So in regards to the air fryer method, I have never tried lechon this way before. So, it's gonna be a surprise, not only for you, but also for me. For the air fryer, I'm gonna put our pork belly straight in, put to 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 40 minutes, flipping every 10. So once again, I have no idea how this is gonna look. It's been 10 minutes. Not bad, I think it looks okay. We're gonna flip around, moving around, and another 10 minutes. All right, it's been another 10 minutes in the air fryer. Let's check it out. Ooh, this one is definitely more bubbly on the skin. We're gonna flip it and put it another 10 minutes. Okay, 
It's been a total of 30 minutes. Let's take a look at the air fryer. Wow, look at that. Blistered the skin. Another 10 minutes. All right, time for the air fryer reveal. Oh, shoot. Look at that. Usually, um, lechon is eaten with sauce like mantamas. It can also be had with just a regular vinegar sauce, which I really, really enjoy. And all you need is chili, garlic, and vinegar. And you're gonna let all those flavors combine while we wait. Welcome to the Battle of Lechon. We're on the left. We have the double deep fried in oil pork belly. And on the right, we have the air fried healthy lechon. And don't forget to ask, how's the taste? What do you think so far? Just by looks, what do you think? Just by looks, um, this looks more crispy. Really? Okay. I mean, this looks crispy hard and this looks crispy, but easy to bite. Okay. They're both crispy, right? What I notice is in the air fryer, as you can see here, there is a lot of fat. Yes. And here, as you can see, there's less fat. Oh yeah, I think it like took off the fat in the air mm. fryer, huh? I feel that the one cooking oil looks more tastier mm. than with the air fryer. Yeah, I think the same too. Well, it doesn't really matter the look, right? The important thing is to ask, how's the taste? All right, so the first one we'll check out is Panglasan Pinoy's. Ooh, crispy. Oh my gosh, wow, look at, look at that, wow. It's like the edge is crispy and on the inside, look how juicy that is, do you see that? That's nice. Next is the air fryer. Ooh, wow. I'm surprised both are looking good, don't you think? Yeah. I thought one of these was gonna be burnt. I think they're both cooked well. It's just thing. this one looks more shrink. I think the fat rendered a lot more in here. We're gonna cut these up and try them. Hey, bro. All right, so first is the skin test. How does that taste? It's really crispy. It's good, the salt, saltiness is good. Next, we'll try the air fryer skin. Mm. Oh my God. What, bad? No, I was wrong. Earlier I said, oh, the oil one mm -hmm. looks like hard to bite, but now the air fryer one is hard to bite. The one in the oil is easy to bite and crispy. You can cut really hard. <laughs> oh yeah, wow. Hard, hard, crispy, like. Okay, I'm gonna try Anglas and Pinois, the traditional style. Mm. Mm. Tastes like pork rind. Nice, salty, very good. I like it a lot. I miss lechon. It's great. Next, it's gonna be the air fryer. Looks super crispy. Got some fat. Oh my God. Wow, yeah. Wow. If you can imagine biting glass, that's how it tastes. Or that's the texture. Like it's so hard and crispy. Yeah. Like I, it's hurting my ears how crunchy it is. So hard. But. I think I agree with you that the yeah. flavor is better here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's interesting. All right, now the regular one, but with the meat. Wow, the meat's so soft. It's crispy outside, but soft inside. Mmm, wow, so good. Delicious. Mmm, I yeah. like it. Well, I think that's why we need to. You would need to put salt when boiling. From last time, you know, I didn't add salt, mm -hmm. so I did. I think it's really good. All combined, wow, mm -hmm. very good. All right, air fryer time. 
compared to the first one, this one kind of a little harder. Dry, more dry. The first one is more juicy and this one kind of a little dry, but still juicy. The skin is really hard. The meat on the first one is more flavorful because of the fat. Mm. Yeah, compared to this, it's like really, really. Yeah, look at the fat on this one, still there. But here, I feel, yeah, it's not as much. Look at the color. This air fryer looks so dry and this one looks so, so juicy. And looks, look at that. Ooh, so juicy. <sighs> Are you still filming? I'm just yes. enjoying. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> I think I made my decision too. Okay. okay, so in the battle of Lechon, the winner is one, two, three. is double deep fried the traditional filipino way is way better yes mm -hmm. so yeah the fat is what's missing in this one all of it got rendered out yes so it tastes healthier but not it, so tasty yeah. and this one in cooking oil is there is it's really soft tender inside there's a lot of skin uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of fat inside and easy to bite and also the skin is Crispy and good. Okay, that's it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any ideas for what chef or food I should try next, please comment down below. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Bye, guys. See you later. How's the taste? You're old. I see this pig just standing, sitting there, and I'm like, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Dito sa Pilipinas, kapag nakita ng may bisita, hindi na gusto ang inihanda namin. Surprise! I think I have a good choice. Bruh.